So in custody cases, you'll hear um, several terms and phrases thrown around, and it's important to know what the court is talking about so that you can understand what you may or may not want to ask for. There's two types of custody. There's legal custody, and then there's residential custody or physical custody. Legal custody concerns um, a parent's right to make decisions for the child, uh, where the child goes to school, what pediatrician the child sees, what extracurricular activities they participate in, and the allocation of that authority between the two parents. Many times the court will award joint legal custody so that the parents have to make those decisions together. Uh, but sometimes joint legal custody isn't the right answer. Um, and sole legal custody will be awarded uh, to one parent, meaning that one parent gets to make all the decisions, all the important decisions, and merely has to inform the other parent of what those decisions are. And then there is residential custody or physical custody, where the child lives day in and day out, what the particular schedule of seeing mom, seeing dad. So if one parent has primary residence or primary physical custody, that means that the child lives more overnights with them than with the other parent. If it's shared, well, that's self-explanatory, half and half with each parent. And then the parent who doesn't have primary residency or primary physical custody, they will either have visitation or sometimes referred to as partial physical custody. And those are the periods of time that they have the child in their care. Uh, so it's important to know what these terms mean as you'll hear them talked about in custody case.